Hello, and welcome to Textile Technical Insights. Some of the chemical substances pose serious health hazards to human beings as well as environment. HF European Chemical Agency has divided these substances into six categories. They are carcinogenic, mutagenic, reproductive toxic, PBT, VPVB, ELOC, carcinogenic, mutagenic, reproductive toxic combinedly called as CMR properties. Let's discuss CMR properties. We will discuss PBT, VPVB, ELOC in a separate video. Carcinogenic A carcinogen is a substance that induces and regulated growth in cells of multicellular animals. This leads to the disease called cancer. Carcinogens damage the DNA in the cells directly, which induces uncontrolled divisions of cell. Cancer is the disease in which normal cells are damaged and do not undergo programmed cell death. When the programmed cell death pathway is damaged, then the cell becomes a cancer cell. Carcinogen substances has been classified into two categories. Category 1 known or presumed to have carcinogenic potential for humans. Category 1A, known to be carcinogenic for humans. Based on human evidence. Category 1B, presumed to have carcinogenic potential for humans. Largely based on animal evidence. The difference is pretty clear. One is confirmed carcinogen, another one is presumed carcinogen. Category 2, suspected human carcinogens. When the evidence obtained from human or animal studies is not sufficiently convincing to place the substance in category 1A or 1B, the substance is placed in category 2. Article 57 of REACH Regulation 1907-2006 is about carcinogenic category classification. Mutagenic a mutagen is a substance that induces heritable change in cells of organisms. A mutation means a permanent change in the amount or structure of the genetic material in a cell. Mutations can either occur in germ cells or somatic cells. If the mutation occurs in a germ cell the effect is heritable. There is no effect on the exposed person. Rather the effect is passed on to future generations. If the mutation occurs in a somatic cell, it can cause altered cell growth cancer or cell death. Germ cells are the only cells responsible for reproduction. Somatic cells are the building blocks of the body. This is the difference. Mutagens are divided into two categories. Category 1. Substances known to induce heritable mutations are presumed to induce heritable mutations. Category 1A. The classification in Category 1A is based on positive evidence from human studies. Category 1B. The classification in Category 1B is based on positive results from in vivo heritable germ cell mutagenicity tests in mammals. Positive results from in vivo somatic cell mutagenicity tests in mammals. What is in vivo study? In vivo refers to study that is done with or with an in-living organism. Category 2. Substances which are suspected to induce heritable mutations in germ cells of humans. Mutagens can cause changes to the DNA and are therefore genotoxic. Powerful mutagens may induce chromosomal instability, causing breakages of chromosome, or rearrangement of the chromosomes. Article 57b of REACH Regulation 1907-2006 talks about mutagens. Reproductive toxic. Reproductive toxicity is subdivided under two main categories. Adverse effects on sexual function and fertility. B. Adverse effects on development of the offspring. Point B means any effect of chemicals which interferes with normal development of baby. Before or after birth. Category 1. 
known or presumed human reproductive toxicant. Category 1A. Known human reproductive toxicant. Classification in this category is largely based on evidence from humans. Category 1B. Presumed human reproductive toxicant. The classification in Category 1B is largely based on data from animal studies. Category 2. Suspected human reproductive toxicant. Substances are placed in this group. When the evidence is not sufficiently convincing to place the substance in Category 1. Effects on reveal lactation, this is allocated to a separate single category under reprotoxic. Human evidence indicating a hazard to babies during the lactation period. B. Animal evidence clearly indicates harmful effect in baby due to transfer of reprotoxic in milk. Article 57 C of REACH Regulation 1907-2006 is about classification of reproductive toxic. Thanks for watching this video. Please like, share the video and subscribe to this channel.